Okay, I'm doing a test on the battery on the fun bit, the Neo fun bit. Um, it doesn't come out really great in uh, a video because it's so bright, um, but it's really quite uh, captivating to the human eye. Um, so this is probably not the best way to view it. But anyway, I'm doing a battery test to see how long the battery will cycle on a, a series of images um, because I um, I charged it for a day and a half. So um, we'll see. It's a pretty large battery. Um, also, so this is kind of a status video. Also now it get a lot closer. Um, you can see the, the case um, that uh, I have made, which is uh, a prototype, so it's not perfect, and there's a lot of uh, things that don't look right in it right now, like the battery and the green casing around it on the back, and the large size of the hole and stuff like that. But but this is a nylon printed case, okay, and uh, it takes quite a long time to print, and I just started another one with the 3D printer here. Uh, my bed is not the most perfect level, but it does come out pretty nice once you once you put that's that's the lid being printed and there's another one like a 10 hour print for the base, but I may change that to PLA because it's warping a little bit. So the PLA won't warp as much and the nylon front will be perfect on top of the PLA. So I think that's gonna work. And then I've also got some switches and some different electronics ordered um, to try out a couple of different things. Um, and uh, now I'm working on the code base as well. Um, so, I don't know what that's all about. Okay, so I'm working on a code base as well. And, uh, and there's a lot of data that was created through graphics um, uh, embedded in those images. See, there's just tons of it here. Okay, that's just a status update. Okay.